Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. Today as you can tell by the title we are back filming another haul and I am so excited about it. I haven't done a pretty little thing haul in so long. I am not going to lie to you guys. Bit of a deja vu sat here because I have filmed this video three times. We're not even going to talk about it, okay? We're not going to talk about it, but we're here today and I'm here to bring you some transitional pieces through to autumn. You can't see everything, but these are the tones. These are the vibes, neutrals, greens and blues, because if you've been here for a while, you will know that's my colour palette right now. And I'm not going to lie, we have literally got 50 shades of green in this haul. If you don't like green, I'm really sorry, but this is not the video for you. But basically, like I said, I filmed this video so many times and because they were kind of like older, I felt like I needed to go back on Pretty Little Thing. This video is in partnership with Pretty Little Thing, but I actually went back on them myself to get some new in pieces because I felt like it it's just too overdue to do some older ones and I wanted to get some new in pieces. So here we are. Let's get into the video. I'm really excited to show you what I've picked up. If you are new here, then please don't forget to subscribe down below and then follow me on Instagram, which I'll put on the screen for you guys. And I just want to say I'm very sorry because this video is very overdue. I was going to film this video like stood up and then putting on the outfits every single time. But do you know what? Doing that, it messes up my hair every single time. So I just feel like I'm going to sit here, talk through the outfits and then I'll insert try on clips in the side. And I'm very excited about it. So first of all, first things first, we have got an outfit from Pretty Little Thing, of course. I'm wearing this one. It's a little bit big, but I kind of think I prefer it to be a little bit big than too small because it's it's one of those pieces that is just like made to be baggy. Well, you have the waist to cinch it in, but like just a chilled loungewear piece. It's just this place so I think it's really cool. I will obviously insert a better trial clip and I just, I love the vibe of it and I feel like it's very autumnal colors. I love like the mix match of colors. I just think it's a little bit cooler. So yeah, this is my first item. I will be leaving everything linked down below for you guys to check out just in case you wanna shop the items. But yeah, this is my first piece and I feel like we're getting the transition into autumn off to a very good start with this item. So I feel like I should start on the greens and I'm gonna start off with another like loungewear. This jumper I was wearing in a picture on Instagram and you guys went crazy for it. So the infamous oversized green sweatshirt I love this colour. Um, I got it in a large, I always get like my sweatshirts in larges because I just love my stuff to be so oversized. But of course you can get it to whatever you would like it to fit like. I feel like it's meant to be like a little bit oversized anyway. But it's just got like this tennis print. I feel like this tennis print has been around for ages. But I still love it. Like I just think it's so cool. And pieces like this are just a staple for me in my wardrobe. I am such like, you know those memes where it's like me and then loungewear that you don't need because you've already got a whole wardrobe of loungewear. But you're going to buy it anyway and they like shake hands. That's me. So that is another item that I love, another loungewear piece. But as you can see, I have ventured out slightly and got some more going out pieces. But um, yeah, we've got a range of things here. We have got a lot of stuff, so I am gonna try and get through this very, very quickly. And then I did get these to go with it. They are slightly different greens, um, but they still look cool together. So these are just a pair of cycling shorts and they're really cool. They're just ribbed boxer style cycling shorts. I got these in a size 10. And I think these are just really cool to chuck on underneath oversized jumpers like that because even though they are baggy, sometimes I feel like I just need a little bit of security with these underneath. And I think this would look really cool with like a white hoodie, a cream one, grey, like they're just really cool. And it adds a little pop of colour if you have them peeping under without it being too much. So yeah, I really like these. I also have a bodysuit um, in this colour and I feel like them together would look really, really cool. I think the colour match is like pretty much spot on. So yeah, that like a green bodysuit with these and like a cream blazer on the top I think would look really cool even black that would look really cool too so what I am going to say is some of this stuff is from the Molly May collection I know that they're planning on restocking it um, I'm not entirely sure if everything's in stock right now but I feel like I'll show you some pieces from the Molly May collection next um, because I love it I feel like this is her best drop the colours can we talk about the colours are uh, unbelievable so i picked up a couple of blazers so i'll show you them first i've actually worn this one out and this tone of olive green is just beautiful i feel like it will flatter so many different skin tones so i got this in a uk size 10 and one thing i will say is it's actually really quite long i was gonna wear it as a blazer dress but the button didn't go tight enough i was gonna wear it with the belt but i was a little bit cautious about it being a bit too short so i didn't in the end but you could actually wear it as a blazer dress too. I just love this so much. I'll insert the picture of me wearing it. I have actually posted a couple maybe in this. Um, 
but I literally am obsessed. Oh, it's got a mark on it. It's probably makeup. This is my first item from the Molly May edit. I just love this blazer. I love the shoulder pads. It's just the most beautiful blazer. Like, you could dress this down. You could dress it up. I mean, if you dressed it down, you could wear, like, a white bodysuit with some denim. Because this colour looks really nice with denim. But then it also looks really good with black. I then also got this one. And this one is actually a blazer dress. Like, you can't wear this as a blazer. It's so long. So, I got this in a size 10. I feel like a lot of this collection came up oversized as it is. So, if you are looking for something a little bit more fitted, I would either say stick to your size or size down. But this is my size, a size 10. I didn't size up and it's massive. So I wore this, well, she wore it in the videos with a belt. You can't really wear this blazer dress without a belt. Um, the white cream one, I don't actually know where it is. It was from PLT, but I insert the picture and I do have it somewhere. And it looks really nice together. Like the colours together look beautiful. This colour green is really, really nice too. One thing I will say, the quality of this new Molly May collection is really, really impressive. I was really, not surprised, but I was really impressed when it came because like the, the materials just felt really heavy. One thing I will say about the previous blazer though is that it's that kind of linen material. So it was so creased, I steamed it. And so far it's kind of like held up quite well considering. But um, yeah, this one's a really, really nice fabric and I love it. But like I said, you will have to wear a belt with it. Otherwise, it just looks a bit unflattering. As you will see in the trial clips, hopefully I'll have the belt to show you. I'm just like scouring my room. Like, where is that belt? Okay, I'm just adding this in whilst I'm trying it on. You definitely need to size down with this because even with the belt on, you can see there's just way too much material. But I do love this blazer. I love the colour and the quality is amazing. But yeah, you definitely need to size down. So, also from that collection, I picked up this, which was a contender for when I went out that evening. I did love it, but I felt like, again, it was just an awkward length. You'll see in the clips, like, it is, you can kind of, like, ruche under, but I feel like it just needed to be a little bit shorter. And I sized down in this one. I got this one in a size 8. I love the colour again. I feel like this is a really perfect piece for, like, um, casual dressy. A good piece for dinner because it's not going to be too tight around your belly. And it's really nice. The buttons are, like, internal, if that makes sense. Like, you do them up and you can't see that it's got buttons. Which I really, really like the idea of. I feel like you might need some, like, tit tape just to keep it secure. But I feel like you could really dress this up as well with heels, a nice clutch, gold jewellery. And you're good to go. So it's, like, a really versatile piece and this colour. I'm really sorry that I keep repeating myself, but I feel like this is one of my favourite colours ever. So nice. And also I feel like this is a really good transitional colour, like a colour that you can wear in summer, but you could also wear it in winter as well and it not look odd. I've got a brown bag that I got from the Molly May collection as well, which would look lovely with this. So I'll show you that next. So for more of a summer vibe, I feel like these look really, really nice together. This bag is kind of like a woven material. I feel like it gives me Bottega vibes. I feel like that's the vibe that's quite popular right now. There was another little bag that I loved. It was like a Jacquemus, Jacquemus, Jacquemus kind of look, um, but it was sold out. But yeah, I really, really like this one. It kind of gives me cross on vibes, but I love it. I think it's super cute. Right, hold up guys, pause the video. I forgot to include the best thing in this haul. Like these have been hands down my most worn piece in my wardrobe this past like month. I am obsessed with these jeans beyond belief. These I will leave linked down below, but you will see me style them a lot on my Instagram already. But also in this haul, you'll see me style them a lot. But these are unbelievable. I am obsessed. They are literally my favourite jean in my wardrobe and I wear them all the time. And I can't believe I forgot to show you guys, but they're literally like the most perfect denim. And I love the little sli side slit. Absolutely unreal perfect literally the perfect jean literally the perfect jean okay let's head back over to blazers because i have got one more and of course it's green but this one's khaki and i love 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 this color for autumn and winter again a beautiful shaped blazer like the padding in the shoulders is just the perfect amount i hate i hate blazers that haven't got enough padding but then i hate blazers that are too much and you literally look like a robot so this is the perfect in between i got this one in a size 12 so it's slightly oversized um i would say it's quite oversized anyway but i love this color i love the fact that it's got a black detail on the button because i love bl black and khaki together um this would look really nice with a black bodysuit some black leather trousers i just think that is such a cool look but also i feel like the thing is with greens and khakis you can wear them with white as well so you could dress this down with a white bodysuit white long sleeve top some 
denim jeans, like light wash denim and some trainers. I feel like blazers, the reason I have so many blazers is because they are so versatile. You can literally whack a hoodie underneath a blazer and be good to go as well. I love the style of like a hoodie under a blazer, leather trousers, chunky trainers. I just love that fit. Like that's just so cool. So yeah, I feel like blazers are definitely a staple for autumn and winter something i do need to pick up i do have one but i feel like i need to pick up more cropped blazers but now on to a blue item i also picked up a couple of shirts in this haul i also posted this on my instagram and you guys love this too i feel like this is a little bit more cool tones so the way i sold it was with a like white top some gray leggings some socks and trainers you know when you have the higher sock i love that look with some leggings um and yeah, that was good to go. So I feel like it's more of a cooler tone piece, but I love this. The material of this is really, really nice. It's not too thick, it's not too thin, so great for the transitional kind of days. And this I got in a size UK 10, and it's definitely oversized, so you don't need to size up on this anyway. But I just think it's really cool. I'll insert the picture that I got. I was actually wearing some sliders that I got from PLT as well, so I'll insert the picture. They are available. They're kind of like the Yeezy style. I love them. They're so comfortable, and I did size up in them, which I didn't need to do because they actually look huge on my feet. Um, but yeah, I just love this. I think it's such an easy piece, and actually, when I wore this, Connor's mum was like, oh my god, I love your shirt. <laughs> it's like, PLT, babe. So of course you guys know I love my neutrals as well. This would not be a live haul without some neutrals. So I picked up this ribbed long sleeve top and I love this. And again, I feel like you could dress this up, but the best thing about neutrals is that you can literally wear it with anything. So this would look cool with leather trousers. I always relate everything to leather trousers in like autumn, winter because they are the best thing to come out of your wardrobe in autumn, winter. If you don't have a pair, you need a pair. But yeah, I really like this. Again, this would look really nice with like a light wash denim. And I love the style of the side buttons. And then I picked up this. This is actually something a little bit different for me. I feel like this reminds me. I follow a girl on Instagram. Her name's Chloe. Chloe Lauren. She has triplets. No, she doesn't have triplets. She has two girls. They're twins. Um, and then she fell pregnant with another little girl within 15 months or something. So they're basically triplets. <laughs> um, but I feel like this is very her style. I get so inspired by Instagram. Like sometimes I feel like, how is this my job? And then I realize everything I buy is from an, like it's recommended to me from an influencer. Like this bloody collection is Molly Mays. She's an influencer. They are literally just, I get all my inspiration from Instagram and YouTube. So yeah, anyways, I like this a lot. I don't know if it's me. I don't personally know how I'd style it. I, lo I know they're really great for this time of year. I feel like this would look really nice with cream leather trousers. Something a little bit more neutral, something a little bit more of that girly kind of vibe. I feel like you guys would not be able to pinpoint my style with this haul because it's just all over the place. But honestly, that is just me. Like, I just see so many different styles that I like. And I think it's nice. I think it's nice to be able to dabble in whatever. But I feel like with some jewellery, some gold hoops like I've got in, the necklaces I've got on, I just think it would look really nice. And a nice, simple piece, but it looks put together. Those kind of outfits are really important when you're a mum. <laughs> ones that make you look like you've got your life together when really you haven't you know because honestly that couldn't be any more me if i tried so i have got another shirt to show you i'll show you that one first this is more again i feel like this is more of a summer piece this was actually from the first lot of stuff that i picked up so it was a couple of weeks ago now but i needed just an overshirt that was like a nice linen color that was neutral I don't really have anything like that and I don't to be honest I don't think this is going to be it I feel like this is a bit more of a summer piece this would look great on holiday because it's kind of like that linen sort of style and kind of just has that kind of boho vibe so if you're going on holiday this would be perfect I love the colorway of this and I do just think this is a really nice piece again you could actually wear it as like an open shirt not like an open shirt but like buttons undone a little bit and just wear it like that with again leather trousers jeans skirts anything it would look really, really nice. I got this in a size 10, but the quality of this, again, just feels really nice. And I love the whole like monotonal look where the buttons are the same color. I love that. So this is a really, really nice piece and I'm sure I could find ways to style it up. But if you're going on holiday, this would be beautiful. Like this would, for me, be a piece that I definitely need to take away with me and just chuck on, chuck on over bikinis and stuff. So yeah, I do really like this piece, but it is kind of a little bit seasonal, I feel. Guys, also just realised I forgot to show you this shirt. I don't know how I missed it out, but I insert a little try and clip on the screen for you guys so you can see what it looks like on. I literally love this. I got this one in a size, if I can see the label, in a size 10. And I also have it in like the teal version, like the light blue version. So I had to pick it up in this colourway as well and I love it. But yeah, I'm so sorry I forgot to show you. I couldn't not 
include it in the video because it's so cute. But next up, we have a loungewear set, like a ribbed loungewear, because I love this ribbed fabric. Like they do it so well on PLT. They had lots of different styles. Oh, I just remembered I did actually pick up some cycling shorts in the same color. So you can get like different styles, but this is just a ribbed olive khaki set which I love. I styled this with an oversized blazer and it looked really, really nice. But I love the leggings on these because they've got like this front button detail, which I think is really, really nice. And the quality of them just feels so nice. I feel like you can size down with these. I did get a medium because they are so stretchy. Neither at all, they're really comfortable. They're just the best things to wear. Like honestly, just so comfortable. And like I said, you can get lots of different styles. So I feel like you can get like a different shaped top as well. And they had so many different colors it's actually a joke so if you're looking for like ribbed loungewear that looks nice again like i said i paired this with a blazer so you can even dress this up and wear it out with some gold jewelry chunky necklaces so nice like honestly so versatile as well so this is the next item this is a bodysuit and it's just like this i don't even know what i'd describe this color blue as i just feel like i have a bit of a complex about my arms like ugh, i don't know it's just a little bit risky for me to wear things like this because i know i don't know if i feel 100 percent comfortable but again i feel like under a blazer this would look really nice but it's also a really nice piece to chuck on with some gray joggers i think would look really really nice i love this color and i feel like hopefully i'll get to the point where i just don't care about my arms we are on a journey we are on the prep for the wedding journey so i got this in a size medium and i do feel like it fits fine i do maybe think i could have got a small because it's quite like can you see it's really long um and because it's like this stretchy ribbed material i feel like i could have got a small but yeah i do really like this and i love the color so the final two items are in fact of course green oh god we're caught up here again i kind of like more summer pieces but again i do feel like they could be transitional so this is a pair of shorts and i love these i love the color of these i love the style of them i like this whole like military vibe and i feel like you could wear like a long sleeve top this is just really good for this time of year like today it's bright blue sky and i feel like if you wore like a long sleeve top or even like a knitted jumper um maybe like a thin knit and tuck them into these shorts i feel like they're just an easy thing to wear I personally would wear this probably with like a t-shirt bodysuit tucked into these shorts and I do really like them. I could bring them through to next year as well. These would be great for the springtime as well as summer and I got them in a size 10. I just think they're really, really nice and comfortable. They're just a comfortable, easy throw on piece. And then finally, I do feel like these are like a summer holiday piece, but picture this. These trousers with a black long sleeve top or black long sleeve bodysuit even a turtleneck, some gold jewellery, some heels. You could make these look, A, they look very expensive, but B, you can make them look really dressy and not so summery. Because I feel like, because they're like the deeper tone, they're easy to like transition into the winter kind of months. And they're a trouser that would look really nice. So these I've got in a size 10. They fit me fine. And when I posted these on my Instagram, again, I've got loads of questions. They're just like a straight leg um, ribbed. But kind of like really like like oh, i don't know what the material is i'm really bad with materials i'm so sorry bright green police high-waisted wide leg trousers so yeah i do feel like they're a really nice piece again if you're going on holiday these would be perfect but i do feel like you could make them like a little bit more wintry a bit more autumnal i just think they're a really flattering kind of style these and like i said they look really expensive but they weren't too bad plt have all the goods right now so thank you so much for watching this haul this is everything i picked up i really hope you enjoyed it i am so sorry there's like like i said i picked some of this stuff up on multiple different occasions i didn't even realize how much green i had until i lined it up but it's okay i'm hoping you guys feel the same way about this color i really hope you enjoyed this video give it a thumbs up if you did stay tuned because i've got lots more hauls coming your way i'm going to be bringing you some transitional autumn winter hauls they're the best kind of hauls i feel like the fashion and autumn winter is just my favorite but yeah i really hope you enjoyed this one don't forget to subscribe if you are new follow me on instagram don't forget to check out plt they also have a youtube channel which i'll leave a link down below you guys should check that out as well that is everything from me today. I'm sorry that I've just chucked a load of words and clothes at your face. And if this video is very long, I'm very grateful you stuck around. But yeah, let's finish the video and I'll hopefully see you guys in my next one.